raced at Albany last night. Um, what have you guys done this morning? Oh God, what haven't we done? Yeah, we uh, we moved the trailer seven times. Um, we worked on both cars, you know, doing the maintenance and stuff. Nothing crazy, um, just general maintenance. And big setup changes from you know the high banks here to Albany last night, which is pretty slippery. Um, so had to make a bunch of shock and spring adjustments, you know, a couple of the gassy adjustments. And see what we got. Uh, we haven't been here in two years. Yeah. They changed the start a little bit. So we'll see what we got. It should be a fun night. Uh, you can hear the cars are getting ready to roll. We're going to go for safety tech and stuff. So we'll, uh, we'll get going here. Hopefully have some fun. Uh, we didn't get to really do a closer much last night because we were all wore out. So, you know, for Dad finishing second, it sounds like there's a little bit of drama. But potentially he should have won. Um, if somebody refused tech, they let it go. So that's, that's not right. Um, I don't care what racetrack you're at. If the guy refuses tech, it is what it is. And I don't care who it is. It could be Brett Hearn. Um, it sounds like he really should have had a feature win last night. So, in my opinion, that's bullshit. So, we'll, uh, hopefully we'll have some fun here tonight. You know, forget about that. We still had a great run no matter what. Nobody's going to take that away from us. Um, we were sitting there ready with our carburetor off along with the other four. So, hopefully we have a good night tonight and have a bunch of fun. So you thought your car was a little bit tight? Yeah, I don't think either one handled all that great. Um, but we're also at a 5 8 mile doing about a buck thirty. So we kind of guessed on some changes and I think they were wrong. So I think we need to go farther. So we just did that. We'll see what we got. We're gonna start at the back of the heat races. So hopefully have some fun. The track's got a ton of grip. So trying to keep you gotta keep it wound up all the time and being tight, you're not wound up. So we'll uh, we'll make some adjustments, see what we got.
still struggled in your heat race with some tightness? Yeah, we were both terrible. Um, I got in a tangle, so bent the front nose up and shit. So. I don't know, we'll see. We're struggling right now. That's how good things can go and then they can go like crap. So we're living it. We'll uh, see if the adjustments we made are better. Um, but yeah, it is what it is. That's, that's racing, unfortunately. I, I said at the beginning of the year, sometimes you're gonna get kicked in the teeth. And right now we're getting kicked in the teeth. So we're not seconds off the pace, but we're not, we're not running with the leaders either. So just the way it is. So we'll keep working.
reapplying some tear offs. What do you guys think of the race so far? Uh, do you want to really know? Yes. It's been, there's some meatheads. Wild. It's been uh, a little wild, a little chaotic. We've used up a lot of equipment already and we're halfway in a 24 or 25 lap feature. Um, so now it rained, which is not going to help the situation whatsoever. And, uh, Already we were building a lot of mud, as you can see, and uh, so, and that was all on my helmet too. So we'll see. Um, we can keep them in one piece, or what it's worth here. If we get to go back green, what the? I mean, it's a big racetrack, so I don't know if they'll they can get it dry. Um, so. We'll they, they threw up two grand and everybody's run over each other. I mean, it took us almost six tries to go one lap. Um, just a completely different caliber, or I don't know, caliber mentality than what we raced with last night. We had one yellow, race hard, nobody touched anybody. Um, here, I swear to God, everybody has to be in your door all the time. So maybe it's a little too fast for some guys. Yeah, I don't know. At the end of the day, it comes down to lack of respect. You know, so we'll see. I have to make a wise decision, you know, and just go. You know what? It's not worth it. You know, run, a, run a couple laps and pull it in. So we'll see. We'll gauge the uh, gauge it and see. These race cars are expensive. So. You already you, you need a new door, I think. Oh, uh, the door's junk. The chrome rub rail's junk. The nose is junk. The toe's knocked out. They won't let me adjust the toe. They'd rather it drive. Terrible, I guess. They told me once we come back green, we can uh, we can adjust the toe. So we're doing it like NASCAR, even though everybody's run over each other, and there's I don't know 14 cars left. So different race tracks, I guess. Different mentalities. So pretty disappointed, but honestly, just with the field. So cars actually we're handling better, um, but I feel like now we're just kind of in the survival mode. You know, I don't think we got a shot to win the race. So, especially with the, way, the surface like this, it's going to be, guys are going to think they're going to be heroes, cars are going to be pushing all over the place, and it might be even more chaos. So, sometimes you just got to make the business decision of, you know what, it's not worth the $200 and the, the wear and tear on the engine and all that. We're going to look at that stuff now. Um, you know, we come here to race, but sometimes you just got to make that decision, especially in a small team. We don't have tons of money and tons of race cars, and we care for race cars pretty quick here. So, we'll see. It's super muddy, as you can see. Yeah. So, We're gonna have just, fun washing that one. Yeah. <laughs> just put more tear-offs on. So. Mind your laundry mat, too. All right. Well, we'll let you guys know how it all ends out.
our first time back at the valley in quite a few years and in 358s now. Yeah. Tell us about the night, guys. Um, it was eventful. Yeah, They're probably more eventful than it should have been. Um, yeah, they were, they, were, they were a little wild tonight. It reminded us of a couple of great races that we ran in 2022. <laughs> um, I think it took four times to get the race started. Um, I ended up with a bent front axle, destroyed right side of the car, um, pretty, pretty beat up. Um, so it was frustrating. Um, a lot of guys driving over their heads, especially after running it like Albany. Um, just the caliber, I guess, of in mentality there is second to none. You can race hard and not run over each other. Um, and it seemed like here tonight, everybody ran over each other, ran half up over your hood. Um, so not not really a warm and fuzzy feeling. You know, we were I mean, we, yeah, beautifully. we were, we're welcomed great. here. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, but just, it was just just a bad race. It was a bad race. Not a good race at all. You know, pretty rough. Everybody so. here was hard, or even you know. The, Officials, everything, they weren't happy. Nobody no. wants that kind of a race. But overall, I mean, we were welcomed back nicely. Oh, yeah. Um, we were motors. thanked several times for yeah. coming. So, yeah. super nice. Track was in great shape. Um, yeah. Even really after fast. the rain delay, they worked really hard uh, to get it all packed in. And it was super smooth and fast. And uh, yeah. you know, it was pretty pretty good racing. So, kind of a one-off in the 358s, I guess. But uh, having said that, we got to see a lot of people. and. Uh, see a lot of our t-shirts that people had bought. Uh, yeah, and I saw really more cool. of our t-shirts in this pit area than I've yeah. seen in Signed yeah. a bunch else. of pictures and stuff like that. So uh, a lot of excited fans, which is cool. It makes so that, feel good. Yeah, it makes you it makes you want to come back again at some point. And uh, it was fun to see a lot of old friends and meet some new friends. Um, but oh, the cars, you know, we got here and, and things weren't great. We weren't good. Um, we weren't good. We worked hard, the whole crew and. and um, worked super hard to get to where we ended up with a couple of top 10 finishes because we certainly didn't have top 10 cars to start with. No, not at all. Um, but we worked, worked, worked and got things changed around and got better and better and better and that's, you know, caps so off a great that. weekend really uh, overall. Yeah, another couple solid runs really. I mean, running the top yeah. 10 with some guys that are really good at racing and for first time being here um, with a small block. Is, it's a completely different race. They, they change the shape of the track almost. So you run down on the flat more than you run on the banking, which yeah. kind of stinks. You know, some people think it's great, but I really don't. I'd rather run up on the banking where you can. But just with a small block, you couldn't at the point in time. So they had changed some stuff up. I heard after too because they have a huge drag race thing going on right now. So they really put the calcium to it to keep the dust down. Um, so it had a little more grip than it has. Yeah, and more tires more because like we chunk a regular tire yeah it had so. some, certainly had plenty of plenty of grip yeah so uh, which we had to do things different because albany on friday was not grip <laughs> so had to had to do a bunch of 180s but overall not too bad um you know cool to be back here and kind of made a little tour for the weekend so yeah it's fun to go cool. fast and, and uh you know happy fourth of july to everybody yeah. um celebrating our freedom and all that stuff that's cool too you yeah. get to do uh, what we do, race. But uh, again, a super thank you to the girls. Um, Dylan worked his ass off uh, all all uh, all weekend. Yeah, uh, couldn't have done this weekend without him. And uh, and, and again with the, the girls' help, because everybody it was hot. So uh, I think everybody at this point is pretty well wrung out. Yep. Um, yeah. It's time to go back home. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we'll be headed home tomorrow. We'll we'll sleep tonight here, and then we'll be back on the road tomorrow. And uh, but everybody who's been watching, we really appreciate it. And it was cool if we saw you. It was great to see you. Yeah. And if we missed you, hopefully we get to uh, see you at the next stop. And yeah. uh, thanks to all the sponsors, everybody who's been helping us get out here. You know, yeah. Stu and Kathy and, and uh, you know, CJ's Auto Body. Uh, WH Builders, WH Building and Design. Akabay. Akabay. Yeah. Akabay. And, Anybody Which, else that's kicked yeah. in a little bit here and there, um, it all it all counts. Yeah. And it, and it uh, without Stu and Kathy, I wouldn't be in the ride that I'm in. So yeah. that's a that's a huge one. Um, and I guess I got to tell Stu that we need another chrome right side rub rail. So hopefully that goes over <laughs> yeah. <all> right. Yeah, <laughs> well, like a right side body. Yeah, a couple so, of door skins. So, but he's good. He was he was happier in hell that we ran well, you know, yesterday. Um, so he'll be happy again tonight. You know, probably one of the best car owners you could have. He's happy no matter what. Yeah, and as long as we're working hard. And, 
know, running good. So we get to see uh, Dave, Dave in the stands. We were waving at him. Yeah. We get to see Kevin Chavian's right there. Yeah, Kevin, yeah, talk race. about a, a weekend run. Where have you raced this weekend? Yeah, uh, Utica Rome Thursday. Friday was Albany Saratoga, and then tonight was here because Devil's Bowl got rained out. And where are you racing tomorrow? Devil's Bowl Speedway. Four yeah. days in a row. Four in a row. Yep. Wow. That's what racing's about right there, huh? <laughs> the life. I think I've passed more cars in the last three days than I've passed all season. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good thing. That makes it yeah. fun, right? Yeah, it was. Tonight was a lot of fun. This place is... You can pull off some pretty good slide jobs here. You can. Yeah. It's a lot of fun, but it, man, does it kill the motor? You better hope it clears oh, it. Oh, I bet. Yeah. <laughs> it, was, it was killing these 358s off, yeah. so I can imagine it was great. I pulled one on. I think it was a 23. Yeah. And I cleared him, but he must have had a really good run because he hit me so hard and my foot came off the throttle. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You'll have that. It was a lot of fun. It was good to friggin' go yeah. fast again and slide yeah. around and yeah. race with a bunch of good guys. Parking's super fast around here. Yeah, Runs a place like a slot car. Yeah, yeah. So. Yeah, I don't know. I'd like to come back again probably sometime, but yeah. we'll have to see what the schedule does. Yeah. yeah. It's cool to tour around. Yeah, yeah it is. So, cool. Cool. See you well, later. Thanks for watching.